Uh, about three years ago, I decided to take the same photograph on my walk every day that I went to create a time lapse and see how it changed over the seasons and over the years. I have created many projects over the last three years, but this project has remained steady while the world has changed around me. I've always been interested in technology and the possibilities that come along with it. AI has been the main technology that I've seen the most development now, and I have been trying to find my own style through these technologies and see how it affects my work. My output is mostly AI enhanced photography and videography. Over this period, uh, my working style has evolved significantly due to this experimentation. I've been immersed in everything AI since my master's in 2020, and I'm currently on an arts PhD in the Irish World Academy of Music and Dance. AI, of course, comes with its pitfalls, just like any new technology. It grips criminals new ways to do crime, and it brings up a host of problems from issues with copyright to misinformation to deepfakes. And artists are understandably annoyed that these apps have scraped their data, downloading and training large language models without permission so that these apps can create any image you can think of. I started focusing mostly on AI music, but there has been a lot more interesting things happening in AI, AI visuals. I found that the most interesting aspect for me is training my own custom generators. For example, I have used some of the best photos from my time lapse to train a custom generator and I've been experimenting with manipulating my own content in new ways. In addition, I have been exploring new ways of style transferring from one or multiple images to another. This has opened up a host of new options for enhancing photography and videography. I'm looking forward to experimenting more with new media. It's exciting time and to be researching now in this field. New apps are being developed weekly, so there's always something new to try out. You can keep updated with my work at kelsey.net, which is C-E-L-S-E-Y dot net.